Hi there, today we are going to go to the Avondale Goodwill. I was hoping all the way there that the shelves would be filled with treasures to share with you. I hope you enjoy today's video. Uh -huh. I actually like that sign. It says hope. It's more contemporary though. The music is blaring. So I'm gonna hopefully, you can hear me, those are $1.99. Look cute. Little uh, plates. Um, paper plate holders. I like those. Nice little wicker look. That actually looks nice together. Back here is a little basket that's made in China. Um, we have some candle holders here. Oh, I just bought my cart. These are flashed. Look. We have a little, a little decor, decor going on here. Looks very nice. Up top is a candle. I wonder if this is old or made to look old. This is a wok. $6.99. I don't know how to bring that back, but someone knows how to bring that back. That's a, that's a nice looking wok. Some more art over here. It's, it's kind of pretty. Look. It's like I'm decorating. <laughs> I don't know how to decorate. All right, do you want to go down this aisle? This is where we just came from. Or look at all the Easter. Let's go, let's just keep our shoulder, left shoulder to the wall. Let's keep looking. Keep looking, keep looking. Here is a dog walk. Oh, that W is kind of weird though. Walk the dog, walk the dog, walk the dog. I was going to say that looks like England and it is England for $2.99. There's only one here, and then here's a whole bunch of candles. Candles, 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 candles. Let's see if there's any uh, glassy babies snuck in here. I don't know if they would know what a glassy baby is. They are always marked on the bottom. They are. It sounded like I said there aren't. They are always marked on the bottom. I don't like these kind of candles because the, uh, the wood wick, I think that's wood, it sounds like water is running. <laughs> I had I got one of those one time. I actually got it at a Goodwill. It smelled really good, but the uh, the sound drove me crazy because I kept thinking, "What is running?" Because it's like like that. So, I'm really I'm personally not a big fan of the candles with the paper wick. It's pretty. What does this say? This says Village Pottery. Oh, I wonder if someone made that in pottery class. They did a really nice job. It's three ninety nine. Very nice. There's a trash basket, a wicker trash basket. That's cute. If I had a booth, I'd probably get that for the booth. It needs to be repainted $2.99. There's some more baskets. I have some long and burger baskets I need to sell. We've gotten kind of gotten a kind of collection. Don't want to get a collection. I want to keep moving them on to you guys. Those are nice, I like those. Okay, we've reached the end of that line. Now we're at the end cap. That's from the Dollar Tree. I say that felt really lightly. I like that. It looks crumpy. We have a glass elephant. Oh, that's pretty. Is it broken? Yes. Its ear is broken. Oh, that's a shame. It's very pretty. Three ninety nine. You could do just play it this way. I think it's missing an ear. There's a pear that's broken there. It's a little dangerous. That's pretty with the Millie Fiore in there. Here we have a fish. Little chips on there. Fish box. Nicely done. Okay, let's see. What lighthouse is this? Barnegat, New Jersey. Oh, it's left in. One little person running away. She's running away from him. Get away from me. These are so tiny. Feel like there was something there. Maybe not. All right, now we are in the tin section. Tin and sunglass section. That's a pretty tin. I don't really do tin, so. Oh, that one says made in Italy. It's a fancy one. All right, so this side, people look at this side, see if there's anything. Here's a candle, candle holder, and a pin, or a pin, a lamp. I have um, some of this punched tin at home. Reminds me, I need to get that listed. 
Oh, are some uh, curtain hooks. There is a flag fold. So these were $39.99. The curtain drawbacks were $4.99. And what's in here? Um, handles were $2.99 on those handles. All different kinds down there. We even moved on to the toys. Who are these trio girls? Behind the squeaks. Oh, it's a, a dog toy. Oh, it's a dog toy for $1.99. Let's see what did they do. It's from a bark box. Tuggable t-shirt ropes, squeakers galore, flip and flip grips. See, Susie needs a new toy. Susie's the only one who does not destroy toys, surprisingly enough. Here's some little made in China bears for $1.99 a piece. Yeah, those are made in China. There's a whole bunch of those. Dollies. Whoops. Uh, let's see. Oh, baby needs a baby needs a body. Let's see what else there is here. Oh, but they have their patterns. Their patterns are bundled for dollar ninety nine. Yeah, their baby patterns and some some fabric squares. This is the craft area. Oh, look at all the yarn. Look at all the yarn, and here's some felt. Nice. There's some fancy yarn in here. This looks just like an average yarn. What's in here? There's a bag of crafts. Bando, glue, glitter. Oh, there's some strippets. Oh, I like looking at these. Let's see. All right, gotta take my glasses off so we can see. Costage Catherine. With the burnout, the. Okay, blah. blah. Crossstitch Christmas, Catherine. Of course, you can have any name. Victorian Carolers. 12 Days of Christmas. I like that. I love the 12 Days of Christmas. Sunset. Maybe that one. Let's see what's this one. Here's Andrea's stocking. Peace on Earth. And here is Santa Collection Stocking. All those things going on there. All right, I'll probably look those up just to make sure. You never know. Let's see what else is in here. I don't see anything else. All right, let me uh, pause for a moment and uh, look up these. I decided to get um, the 12 Days of Christmas, the Peace on Earth Angel, and the Santa Collection in the Toy for Season. Here's a uh, wall quilt, friendship quilt. Looks like it's just a pattern. I don't know if any fabric came with it. Uh, yeah, I, all fabric included. No, not anymore. It's just a pattern. Let's see what else. We have cards and some other little uh, gift bags and a tablecloth. Oh, here's a little kit here. Little kits are always fun. Wooden ornament kit. Oh, well, that's a good sign. Someone donated their antique booth to uh, Goodwill. That's a dollar ninety nine. Maybe there'll be other uh, Goodwill or antique booth items in here. Let's go back down this aisle. We were just over in the baskets. Remember, now we're in the Halloween section. Super cute things. Uh, even though I do put my videos to that noise reducer, I have noticed that I have to keep talking or my sound gets really muffled and the music is continually playing. So I'm going to be continually talking <laughs> while we look at the items so it doesn't sound too weird through that uh, noise eraser. Noise eraser app, I think it's called. Oh, look, here's a Glacier candle holder by Tao Toll. Austria, not a, uh, not a, uh, what's it call it? A, uh, oh, I can't think of the word. Costa Boda, not Costa Boda, but very similar to Costa Boda. Let's see what else, what else? Uh, I just see more contemporary Christmas. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else is up here. That's a bundled item, which is always nice. A couple of those, a couple of the same things there. Mm -hmm. They're announcing in Spanish about how you should donate to Goodwill. They do that now. Oh, look at the Valentine. 
They spread out the Valentines. Spread the love. Valentine doesn't we don't really find a lot of Valentine things. And then like St. Patrick's Day is decorated. 1990, they have a nice decorated here. That's cute too. We have a little hobbyist hat, $2.99 on that. This is another little hobbyist piece. Oh, his his eyes light up. Oh, well, they used to light up. Interesting. And then here's Easter. We looked at Easter when we first came in real quickly. Let's see. Here's a hobbyist piece. That's cute. MB, that's very sweet. That's nicely done. Oh, look. It's Stink Eye Joe. It's Stink Eye Joe, but he has a broken ear. Aw, I've sold him twice now. He He's had a repair and it chipped his ear. Oh, Stink Eye Joe. I love you, Stink Eye Joe. All right, here's the other side. We were just over in Easter. Turn the corner. Kind of sparse on this side. Kind of sparsy on this side. Yeah, I see something here that's missing. It's missing a lid, though. Oh, these snuck over from the Halloween section. Laying, look, there's a candy corn bat, candy corn witch. Oh, those were cute. I might just look those up. Oh, gosh, they're $3 a piece, though. Maybe not. Well, I'll look them up for future reference. Oh, these are really lightweight. Um, look them up for future reference. Look at this cat. Oh, look, a cat has a mouth in its mouth. That's so funny. Who makes that? HOL 1996. That is so funny. That, I really like that. Because he's, he's a little chippy right there on the corner of his ear. How much is it? Tags inside. How much is it going to be? Three ninety nine. That's so funny. And look, he has more mice in his and <laughs> more mice in his hands. Let's see. I think these are hobbyist pieces here. Oh no, they're not. Popular art, handmade by Lem in Greece. Ah, huh. popular arts. They look like hobbyist pieces because they're kind of rudimentary there. All right, let's look these up to see what they are. Those are super cute. Found a listing that's uh, new in the box. It's uh, espresso cups, and they are selling. Uh, I think it was listed for twenty three. I'll insert the picture here. Uh, it's supposed to be three, six, nine, twelve. So it's a, just would make half of that. Uh, they're super cute. If they were bundled, maybe, but I'll leave them for somebody else. Very, very cute, but uh, only one listed. Um, oh, and I wonder, this is, I do like this. I like that it has a mouse there. Okay, we'll get that. We'll get that. <laughs> That's, I like it. And then this is a cute little kitty cat. Let's see, made in China, a little resin kitty cat. And here's some more. Oh, this is, um. this goes in the inside a watering for your violets. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. I, I think that's what that is, because this is not uh, glaze. It would sit inside a pot. Oh, this reminds me of um, the office on Pam's desk. She had this. Look, it even has the little spoon. That's so funny. That's in really nice shape. It's only $1.99. I might look that up, too. Why not? <laughs> I'll sell anything. <laughs> I've even sold a trash can one time. Let's see. From Mel and Linda for 1985 Christmas. Made in Japan. Three ninety nine. That's a nice looking horse. Oh, it has a little chip on its ear though. Oh, that's nice. That's a nice horse. So I might like that up too. I decided to go for that. Uh, I just did it. Did. <laughs> um, and I do like this horse. Let me back up a little bit. I do like this horse. There is a tiny little chip right there, but um, I think that's forgivable. The legs and the tail. I like that it's uh, Japan and that you know it's from 1985. And horses do sell well. I think because you don't see a lot of horse things. At least I don't see a lot of horse things. Let's see if there's any other uh, interesting things that we can find here. Here's a bag. Oh, bag of birds. A bag of magnets. And some bunny things. Oh, a bunch of bunny things made in Taiwan. Oh, they're ornaments. Little bunny ornaments in the frame. Oh, we've come to the creepy doll section. <laughs> there are the creepy dolls. The nutcracker. Oh, she's pretty. She's very fancy. 
he's a fancy boy. He's missing a shoe. Being a friend is no small thing. It's a huge thing. Oh, it's Hallmark. It's a nice bowl. Let's see what else we have here. Oh, here's the Hummel plates. How much are they selling those for? Five dollars a piece. Hummel plates. Hummel, 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 hummel. Hummel, 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 hummel. Don't really see anything I need there. We have a palm tree. And it looks like a pineapple. Oh, this is cute. Look at the little egg cup. A dollar ninety nine. Like uh, she has a fly swatter. <laughs> Maybe it's supposed to be a butterfly, a butterfly net. That's sweet. Some more plates. Do they have any main plates? Oh, this one. It says nineteen seventy nine. Bridget's. Mm-hmm. These look like they go together. These kind of go together. It's good she needs over. They look like they go in kind of fashion. Fashion plate. Oh, oh, literally a fashion plate. Someone's art. Oh, someone else's art. Oh, here's some more egg cups. Oh, and some kitty cats. Ah, my cart's running away. Oh, wait, what's this? We have Mary. Mary. Put her in the egg cup. Let's see. This little kitty cat. I think it got broken off something. This little chalkware cat. $1.99. That's sweet. It has uh, chipped ears. Trinket with a butterfly on it. Made in China. May poison your food. Oh gosh, she's been in the wars. Ooh, she needs to be cleaned up. Like she's in someone's kitchen. I think you can see anything else here. All right, we have another bag. Orange cat. Sure. A little left in the Christopher collection. Nothing too exciting in here. Look how big they are. That's so funny. You know, we've skipped over a couple aisles because there really wasn't much. Here's a, all the clear glass, which is pretty wild. And then over here is clear glass as well. You never know. I would not discount the uh, clear glass. Let me back up a little bit. Don't discount the clear glass because uh, sometimes you can find something good in there. This is very pretty. That's very heavy. It has uh, some... some damage in there probably can be cleaned up oh this little guy needs to be over in the st patrick's day section you never know and then also if you're in the clear glass section pops of color you know pop out at you because uh you're used to having everything clear so i i don't mind the clear glass section i actually like looking through it because you never know you never know what treasures you might find in here i think all this is just some regular contemporary this is this m this is uh, aqua. I was going to say that looks like a water bottle because it has a water droplet there. Pretty cobalt blue. Oh, here's a Pacific Northwest. Uh, looks like a, um, I would guess a raven or an eagle. Hard to tell. Very super excited. We are, Jenny and I are going to Alaska. Oh, that's Avon. Going to Alaska in June. Definitely will be filming and bringing you along on that excursion. Ooh, look at this. This is this plastic. Yeah, I was going to say that looks like it's plastic. That's sweet, though. It's a sweet little basket. Bringing you along on our trip. And uh, looking forward to that. It would be fun uh, showing Jenny Alaska. And the last time I was in Alaska, oh gosh, it's 100 years ago. The year started with a 19. Let's just put it at that. Uh, this is Fitz and Floyd. It chips super easily. The Stork Club, as you can see, someone loved it so much they repaired the neck on there, got broken, and there's chips here. They always had unusual collections, Fitz and Floyd. I wonder what the rest of those look like. That's a shame that's broken. There's any other uh, mugs here. 
I will let you know if I see anything that stands out to me. I didn't find any mugs because I didn't show anything else. This is really pretty. It's Home Studio with the seashells on it. There's two leaves. Um, I don't know who makes Home Studio. Oh, Coles. I was going to say, I don't know who makes those. Those are nice. $2.99. Those look nice together. If there's anything else. Anything, anything, anything else? I wonder if no one even used those if they bought them and didn't use them because they still have that paper in them. Interesting. There are two listings uh, for these, but it's just one, and one is $12 and one is $14, um, and I can get both for six, you know, $7, and then I would sell them together, make sure that they're not, uh, so I think these are really nice, I think some of them might like that, this one, seashell is a little bent that way, and bent, bent here, but I think it's forgivable, I think those look pretty nice, they would look nice together. Look, I found the Mona Lisa. I can retire. Nice. And then over in the food section, or food section, in the plate section where you use food is up from Pyrex Crazy Daisy bowls. Uh, look, you have the whole stack for $4.99. Um, this is the stack my mother-in-law had, or that's not the stack. This is the pattern my mother-in-law had. Um, and then how much is this stack of plates here? This is nice that they bundled them because usually they don't bundle. Two ninety nine. They have surface wear to them, and then look at the um, look at all these. Like, look at it's such a great deal. I think it's a great deal. Let's see, two ninety nine. They're all bundled. Um, if it had the different pieces, like the I'm thinking the butter, a prior, uh, salt and pepper, gravy, some unusual pieces, then I would pick that up. But uh, I think this is great. I always say, if you're starting out your household or you want to start new, come to Goodwill or um, the Salvation Army, some kind of thrift store, and get your dishes there because then you don't spend a lot of money. If they break, you don't really feel too terrible about it. Wait, I see a tiny little, tiny little individual. Is this a little individual butter thing? Oh, the handle's broken. That's so sweet. Not for food use. Oh, it might poison your food. All right. That's why it's over there. They also have the Franciscan Desert Rose pattern. Uh, this is the TV. They call that the TV mark. That's the older mark that uh, is, I believe, is more desirable. Um, these are saucers. I wonder if they had these bundled in the rubber band rope. These are just piled on top of each other. Yeah, but that is the um, the older logo that I believe is more desirable. Um, and again, if they had a the covered butter dish, is a really good thing. Uh, things that get uh, salt and pepper, covered butter, gravy boat, stuff like that. They just have the saucers here, so I'm not going to get them. Okay, this is going to end our trip here. I got the cat, got a couple of these uh, Christmas stocking kits, two of the photo frames, a toy for Susie, the horse, and the candy container. You like your ladies? They're ladies. <laughs> you like your ladies? I, the most obscure dog toy I, I thought it seen. was a weird uh, kid toy, and I was like, wait, what? It's a doggy toy for Susu. That is hilarious. Isn't it funny? They're like dancing That's girls. So you like you? I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and also thank you so much for the birthday wishes that you sent me. That really means a lot to me. I hope you're having a great day. Take care, and I'll see ya.